handed tonight that came up with the win, opening statement? Uh, just a quality road win. It's a team that's been playing well, just coming off a really good win, obviously, in Seattle. Um, so nice way to start the road trip off. I um, was really happy, obviously, with our defense uh, holding a team to 73 points. I thought, you know, uh, those are areas where we've had slippage here and there. And um, thought we kind of tiptoed into the game a little bit. But um, after about six, seven minutes, I think they found their rhythm and we found uh, what we kind of wanted to do uh, more defensively. Um, and then I was able to carry that out throughout the game. Andy? Jerica, rough shooting I've heard, but she comes up big in that final possession, or not final possession, near the end, that little scoop layup. How big was that from her? And, you know, this seems like something that she just does. It comes up big for you guys when you need her. Well, I mean, it was her only bucket of the night, and it was a huge one. Um, but you can look at the stat sheet and see her impact on the game. Um, she does a lot more for us than just, you know, scoring. Um, she's typically uh, assigned the toughest player on the other team, whether that is, you know, NECA, Candace, Stewart. I mean, you could go down, Deladon, you could go down the list. I mean, she has her hands full every night. Um, and she does a great job. I mean, at the end of the night, you look at her staff, <laughs> she's plus 20. So uh, her impact on the game, uh, you can't really quantify it. Uh, and I was all over her because I felt like she was fouling a little bit. Um, but once she locks in, she's she's hard to get around. Definitely. And then your two all-star starters, Asia and Kelsey, come up big for uh, you guys on offense on a night where shots aren't falling. You know, how impressive is it what they did tonight? Well, uh, you know, Jackie was a little dinged up tonight, um, trying to get Bay back in some minutes. So um, for, for Kelsey and Asia to kind of take take the reins there when um, we're a little battered and bruised in some other spots, uh, I, I thought was big. I thought uh, Plum's floor game. Um, was just really good tonight. She was really solid. She was composed, especially down the stretch. Um, we were just able to find uh, and, and get the ball in the right people's hands. Um, and like I said, down the stretch, our, I, I thought the defense won the game for us because it's not like we were hot or any good on the offensive end tonight but <laughs> for a couple people. But um, when nights are rough like this, you want to be able to rely on your defense, and, and we were able to do that. TC? Hey, Becky, obviously without Chelsea tonight. Can't hear you, TC. Um, sure can you hear me? You can't hear me? Check, Try check. again. Can you hear me now? Yes, is there a... Can you get me? It should be up. Didn't... Can you got me? Yep. Check, 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 check. There you nope. go. Yes. You got, Good. you got me now? Okay. Uh, Becky, talk a little bit about... Um, about uh, Bay and Kia tonight. I mean, obviously without Chelsea, you needed to, to mix and match and you needed to, people to come in and, and help you out. Talk about those two specifically. Well, with Krona, we're just trying to shake some cobwebs, uh, get, her, get her some minutes. Um, with live action, you really can't simulate that kind of stuff in practice. Um, just kind of see how she felt. Obviously she was on a pretty tight minutes restriction. So we adhered um, to, the, to the medical advice there. Um, I know she wanted to play more, but not a bad start to get out and, and running. Why is this so dark? Okay. Um, and then Kia, I just thought, uh, I, I just, they're a very big team. They're a very athletic team. I liked her length down the stretch in our defense. Like I said, um, we were able to, you know, do some things defensively, uh, that we actually went to last game, late game, and I thought it worked well. And then we did this kind of the same thing tonight and I thought it worked, worked well again, but, um, her rebounding, her length, uh, she's obviously a vet, so she knows how to play in these big moments. Um, so I, I, just, I just rolled with her because I thought she was playing so solid defensively. All right. Okay, thanks. Matthew? Hey, Coach. I know you talked that uh, Jackie was a little banged up tonight. and you know She didn't have her best offensive game, but she finished tonight with seven assists. What does that say about her on a night you know, you're missing – your main one of your main ball handlers in Chelsea Gray that Jackie can come in and give you seven assists and find open teammates on top of trying to look to score. Well, it's probably one of the most uh, undervalued part of, parts of her game. I mean, she's she's a three one, which is a weird combo. Most of the time, people go three two, or you go two one, or uh, it's a very rare combo that you're a three, and then your next best position might be at point guard. And she's one of those uh, just rare birds that that's the case. Um, I have no problem putting the ball in her hands, letting her play call or run actions. Um, 
throughout the course of the game. So to me, she, she, Kelsey and her, I just wanted Kelsey or Jackie out on the floor at all times um, for that point guard position. And um, to be quite frank with you, uh, we didn't want Sykes near the ball. So whoever she was on, we wanted her away from the play and the other one bring it, whoever that was. Doug Feinberg. Hey, Becky. Uh Curious if you can talk a little bit about Kelsey's development. I know you worked out with her, I think, one day last year when you were in Vegas, but just the development you've seen of Kelsey this year as a player, I mean, she seems very confident in offense and defense so far this season. She's always been a confidence player. Uh, you know, I, I think she's very confident in her skill set. I think her most growth has come um, with just her willingness to pass um, and play with her teammates. I think that makes her unguardable. Um, because she does so many other things. And when uh, she starts to, un and she has already started to understand that the pass can be a valuable tool to her offensive game. Um, she only had two assists the other night, but honestly, I thought she could have had seven or eight had we shot the ball decently. Um, and same thing tonight. She could have easily had eight, nine assists had, had we shot the ball decently. So she's playing the right way. Um, and when she does that, uh, you're going to see her shooting numbers continue to stay at that 50% clip. Uh, like they were tonight because you just can't take it all away from her. Um, but I thought she played a great floor game tonight. Um, defensively, uh, she just likes challenges. You know, she knows she's small, um, but she, used a, she uses the schemes and uh, a lot of hustle to get things done on the defensive end. So I've been pleased all with her all around game, honestly. Um, and then her growth as a leadership at a leadership spot. Um, She's accountable. She's self-accountable first. She knows how to hold other people accountable. And uh, that's just fun for me to watch, actually, kind of just bloom in front of your eyes, seeing her take those steps. Um, I thought she was composed tonight. Um, just really solid all the way around. Thanks, right. Becky. Let's go two more. Paloma? Yeah. Can you hear me, Coach? Yeah. Okay, awesome. I'm so sorry if you already answered this, but do you guys expect to play without Chelsea uh, this week? Uh, we're not sure at this point. We're obviously in constant communication with her. Um, I just told her to do what she needs to do. She's a pro, um, but family comes first. And so uh, I know she's itching to get back with her teammates, but there's some things that these ladies got to take care of at home first. So uh, I, quite frankly, I don't know. Okay, thank you. All right, let's finish off with Jose. I know you're having a little bit of audio issues, but go ahead and ask away. I'll make sure you get the file. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we can't hear you, Jose. So we'll come back to you. The kids from Miracle Marketing, do you guys still have a question? Hey, Becky. Hello. Congratulations on the win tonight. How important was the win, knowing you're on a Wednesday road trip? Well, it was important, uh, obviously, to start the road trip, right? Um, but we also needed to start uh, <laughs> winning again. Um, so it, it was good to get um, a road win. It's, it's really tough to beat a team three times, any team, any league. Doesn't matter what league. Um, it's, it's really difficult to, to beat a team three times. So uh, I was really pleased with the way the ladies came out and really down the stretch were able to close that game out. Thank you. Coach, we'll let you go. We'll be back with Asia, Kelsey, and Jackie. Oh, dear. I know we in LA when them 